Hey, comicbook.com. It's Meredith. We are here with Jason O'Mara, the new top dog at S.H.I.E.L.D. Did you uh, get your own keys to your own Quinjet? Um, well, I mean, I, when you're this high up, people people drive for you. It's kind of like Uber Select. Oh, that's pretty Uber nice. Uber Black. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, you know, so you got some people to do the flying for you. All right, that's fair. Yeah. I mean, you could still take it out, though. No one would question it, right? Well, actually, we were talking about how um, Mace gets around. When you're this high up, this this mm -hmm. much of a, you know, level clearance, it's almost like you don't even have to swipe your card. You just kind of walk up to a door and they just open themselves. <laughs> that's so, so it's magical. the same thing with Quinjets. They just like take off when you get on board. And that's not even your own human power. That's just director power. That's just director power. That's just from being the top dog. Yeah. Yeah. So what's that like? They brought in an inhuman to run S.H.I.E.L.D. now. That's got to not sit well with some people. It might not sit well with some people, but I think Mace at this point is like, hey, deal with it. You know, I'm an inhuman and that's who I am and I'm not going to apologize for it. That's my truth. And deal with it. And uh, I think that's quite admirable. And I also believe that he has a lot of respect for other inhumans and anyone else who might feel um, different from the norm. So um, I think that's got to be a good thing. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, there's all this mystery surrounding his backstory and who he is mm -hmm. and how he got to where he is. And, you know, if he did go through Terragenesis, when did that happen? How long has he had his powers? Has he ever used them before? Like all these things need to be answered, yeah. I feel. So um, that's going to be really interesting over the next few episodes to see how that storyline evolves. Yeah, it's going to, I know the fans are, are super excited about that. Now, um, how how about you said with other Inhumans, uh, speaking of a major one, you got Daisy kind yeah. of on the run. How is Mace going to handle that when they catch up to her? Mace has a real problem with Daisy in that she's been fraternizing with Robbie Reyes, who's a known fugitive terrorist, murderer. You can't just go up to gang members in prison and burn them to death and barbecue them. Senator Nadir, played by Parma Nagra, she knows this and is exploiting this to its fullest. So um, Mace is in a lot of hot water when it comes to Reyes and by association also by Daisy. So how he, and he's all for legitimizing Daisy Johnson as a member of, uh, as a, becoming a, a proper shield agent, but at the same time, how he's going to do that, overcome this Robbie Reyes problem and the Nadir problem will all be explored in the next few episodes. That's exciting. Now, um, so we've got Coulson back, you've, your director. How does a guy like Mace get along with a guy like Coulson? You know, they, they, I think they ultimately want the same thing, but they're going at it from completely different angles. Um, the one thing I like and, and that I think is quite redeemable about Mace's character is that he often defers to Coulson and asks him for help um, when he needs it. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, Mace is under a mandate from the government. Um, he didn't get this job just for the fun of it. He's got certain things he has to do in, in a certain way and he has to protect S.H.I.E.L.D.'s legitimacy the whole time. And Coulson, on the other hand, would be willing to go to any lengths to protect his friends. So those two agendas are going to clash. Um, also, we have the addition of uh, Talbot, um, played by Adrian Pazdor, and how he fits into the Coles mace relationship is going to be interesting as well. It's like they're almost like the Three Stooges, these guys, uh, and, and obviously very headstrong alpha males. And, and so, yeah, how they interact is really fun. But um, the, the mace Colson relationship will be very much front and center over the next few episodes. So uh, I can't wait for audiences to see that. There's so much I can't say, <laughs> but uh, I, I have to say it's really, really exciting. Mm -hmm.